What's up, y'all boys? No, it's like, it's prom time. I'm gonna watch a video of uh, TJ Top Shelf. I saw the other two, but I didn't react to them because uh, I didn't really know what it was. Uh, but it's, it's, is it okay, TJ? Well, is it okay? Yeah, TJ. Um, the last one. <laughs> Let me stop. The last one, like, these jokes be funny, though. Like, all TJ videos be funny. Um, I'll say probably one of the funniest was the, uh, the video with Champ with, uh, what was it? Oh, wow. One of them videos with Champ, that's, that's one of the funniest, but he got a lot of funny stuff, so, you know, just, you know, go subscribe to the boy. <laughs> What's up, right. y'all? It's CJ Top Chef, and welcome back to Is It Okay? A lot, a lot more of you guys caught on to the last video, and it's not an inside joke, guys. It's like, it's simple. But then again, I don't want to like address it because I don't want it to like be a thing that I say everybody should do and then they never do it. It's more like if people catch on to it, they'll do it. And if they don't catch on to it, then it won't happen. And if I acknowledge it, then it still might not happen. So I don't want to acknowledge it. I'm going to just let y'all continue doing it the way y'all are doing He's just going to have to let but, it slide. Uh, I really appreciate those who are doing it. So this next question comes from a female. Usually the female com uh, controversial questions usually may vary depending on their situation. Sometimes it may, sometimes it may not. Same thing with guys, but in this situation it doesn't vary. It's the same thing. If you already, if you don't remember how this, you know, video goes, basically I ask you guys uh, controversial or hypothetical questions, and you basically when I when I do the pause thing, you're supposed to pause the video. And let me know if, if you think it is okay to do this or if it's not okay. And then after you guys do that, then I basically let you guys know my answer to it. But I want to do it differently this time. The question is, is it okay to steal something or take something from someone if you know it will not be missed? Say, for example, your cousin has five pairs of headphones and they just don't use certain headphones because they have so many. So you steal some instead of asking for some because you know they would say no Bruh. for whatever reason, but you steal some anyway. Bruh. Is it okay to take it if you know they won't miss it? Let me know in the comment section below. When I pause the video, uh, I want you guys to pause the video and let me know in the comment section below if you think it's okay or if it's not okay. I'm on Instagram. All right, pause. All right, bruh. <laughs> I think you was talking to me directly, bruh. So, um. When I was younger, me and my cousin used to have these uh, WWE action figures. This dude had like 50 or 60 action figures. And I only had about 5 or 6. And his, I had to, you know what? Hold on a minute. So, alright, look. For example, right? I had this kind. The, the kind, I don't, I don't like this kind. Because it's not flexible. You can't really do much with it. But this is the kind I had. And I had people like this. I had like Valley. I had like um, who did I have? I had like Chavo Guerrero, and uh, stuff like that. And you know, you know, and he had like, he had <laughs> people like this. The flexible people. He had the the um, the steel cage ring, the raw ring, the hell in the cell ring. He had like every ring, the SmackDown ring. I only I didn't even have a ring. I would just <laughs> we were just doing hardcore matches uh on the floor and stuff. Uh, like he got, he had everything. He had all the championships. I ain't had no championships. Um, and like, what? It, like I was at his house and we was we. I bought mines over, and then um, I ain't gonna lie, I took a few. Uh, I took a, I took a John Cena when he had the. I mean, even though even though it was the John Cena like this back then, them John Cenas was raw. But he had, it was when he had the little green shorts and the black thing on his arm. The, that was a word like John Cena. He had the things on his hand. I, I took a under, uh, deluxe Undertaker. I remember that. The one with his, he come like this. Like, yeah. Uh, which one I, I took? I took a, um, I took like two more. I mean, I took, yeah, I took two more. I took four and all. And I took a championship. And uh, I had it at my house. And then he came back like the next week. To, uh, we came back next week to play, and then 
uh, I had to hide them from him, obviously. <laughs> and then, uh, I tried to take some more. And I tried, like, I got a recliner, and it's like a, a pouch in a recliner, so I tried to ease it in the recliner. <laughs> and then, uh, and then, uh, you know, he was, he about to leave my house. He was like, wait a minute, one of my things missing. I, mean, I ain't going to leave till I, till I get it. I was like, I don't know where it's at. Is it under there? Is it under there? You must gonna have to leave without it. He was like, nah, bro, I ain't leave you without it. I was like, bro. All right, bro. Pull that game to him. <laughs> I mean, that was a story, but it, I mean, it's not right. But that's it, kind of it's kind of a hard situation because it's not right at all. But it benefits you. <laughs> but, uh, See what TJ got to say. Hitting that play button. I'm telling y'all, this is kind of awkward for me if y'all didn't pause the video and let me know. But anyway, my opinion. Do I think it's okay? I'm not going to lie. When I was younger, I used to do shit like that. I used to always, like, say, oh, my God, they won't miss this, man. They won't miss it. And I didn't used to just, like, just, like, go on a steal and just put a whole bunch of shit in my bag. But nah, I ain't doing all that. where I did think that like somebody didn't want something so I needed it or they didn't need it so I wanted it so I just took it but now that I got older I noticed that if I see something in my room that I know I have not you know been using for real but I know I will use it in the future for some specific reason let's say I have a case for a phone and I don't have that phone yet but I plan on buying that phone in the future but the person that's at my house has that phone now and they see I don't use it because I don't have that phone yet, but I did plan on buying it like next month. They don't know. They never asked me. So they decide, they decide to take it because they think, oh, he won't miss it. I mean, he doesn't even have that phone anymore. I don't even let nobody in my room. Comes so. And then I need the phone. You got to think of it like that. They might need it. So I don't think it's okay. I mean, I used to think it's okay, but now I don't think it's okay because eventually you don't know if somebody's going to need that. What if that person that has those five pairs of headphones ends up having some type of trouble in the future down the road and they need to sell the headphones or something like that. You never know. Maybe they have a party later on and everybody needs a pair of headphones for whatever reason. You never know what the situation is. <laughs> the headphones is the password. If they say word. no to you having it, obviously they have some type of reason why they're holding on to it. Maybe their parents bought it for them and they're not the type of person that gives stuff away. Thing was, I didn't even, I didn't know. even ask. So no, I don't think it's okay. <laughs> I just, I used to think it's I just okay, had a feeling it was gonna I be no. Why people may think it's okay? Yeah, I did. But ask I personally you. don't think it's okay. And don't forget, if you didn't let me know if you thought it was okay in the comments below, let me know that. Go ahead and give it a thumbs up if you're enjoying the series. If there's something that you've thumbs done up. that you don't think is okay, or if you want to know if it's okay, just let me know on the social media or in the comment section. I actually or any of my messages didn't even ask anywhere to borrow. The hashtag, I borrowed. Okay, I asked me know to borrow. A, um, you think it's okay. a Joey I Styles in the suit, so I can have an announcer. And he was like, "No." So because then after again, that, I don't have to say so and say what's okay and what's not. But I will give my personal opinion and have my people in the conversation give their personal opinions too. Hopefully, you're enjoying the series because I damn sure am. And uh, yeah, man. Uh, I don't know if I got a certain. I don't know if I got a certain question yet. Uh, probably not yet because. I don't really, uh, I don't know. I have to really, really, really think of one, and then I'll get that back to you. But, uh, my boy TJ video, yeah. Is it okay? I mean, it's not okay, but as a kid, you know, grow up. So, you know, uh, you think it's okay when you're a kid, but now you grow up. And, uh, yeah. So, go subscribe to the boy TJ. And... See y'all later.